Hi, EQ guy here. There was a 5.4 earthquake that struck the Los Angeles area with the epicenter of La Habra on Friday evening. That would be March 29, 2014. 13 aftershocks over 2.5 and a total of 125 earthquakes involved in the whole thing. So there was like 121 aftershocks all totaled. The felt report from this was way too big for me to write up. It'll take me a couple of days, as well as the total list of earthquakes. I usually like to post that too. No way. Here's what some of the ones on the list are. 350 felt reports from Anaheim, 2 from Bakersfield, 60 from Beverly Hills, Brea, beautiful little downtown Brea right there, very near the epicenter. There's hardly 295 people in Brea, but they have 295 reports. Burbank 96, Camp Pendleton 16. It was also felt in Cardiff by the sea, Carlsbad, Capistrano, Castaic had four felt reports, Dana Point 27, Flagstaff, Arizona had one uh, felt report. There was also Las Vegas had five, and then Phoenix, uh, Phoenix, Arizona also had two. Long Beach, 556 felt reports. Los Angeles, 1,283 felt reports. Los Oliv Olivios, that is the uh, Michael Jackson's Neverland Ranch, one felt report from there. 349 Huntington Beach, um, Malibu 10, Northridge, the epicenter of the Northridge earthquake, 32. There, I also in my uh, research found a felt report from Northridge on the Great Alaska Earthquake, which was 50 years ago Friday also. The Great Alaska Earthquake of 1969. One felt report from Northridge on that, and it was also felt uh, reported to be felt in Indianapolis and in uh, Lincoln, Nebraska, and more about that later. 32 felt reports from Oxnard. They also mention uh, the town of Oxnard in the new movie Cesar Chavez. Great movie too, but let's move on here. Four felt reports from Panoramic City, 254 from Pasadena, one from Paso Robles, 288 felt reports from San Diego, five from Santa Barbara, 122 from Santa Monica, four from Santa Paula, 39 from beautiful downtown Silverado down there in San Diego County, 22 from Silmar, three from San Fernando, Santa Ana, a lot. There was just too many to count them and they're coming in as I'm reading this. Topanga, six. Tijuana, Mexico, two. Torrance, another one with too many to uh, list here. A lot, it says. 29 Palms, 33. Universal City, two. Ventura had 19 felt reports. Victorville, 58. Whittier, 123, but Whittier's right there, so it's one of those where you pretty much assume that everybody in Whittier knew it was an earthquake because it was a big earthquake and it was only like a mile from Whittier. Yucaipa, 35, and Yucca Valley, 27. Exact moment of the new moon, March 2014 new moon, will be 11.48 a.m. Pacific Time Sunday. That's tomorrow as I write this. So it is a full moon earthquake watch right now while I'm reading beginning 11:48 a.m. Pacific Saturday and that will run through 11:48 or basically all day on Monday finally there have been a lot of tornadoes we're already getting tornadoes in the Midwest tornado season probably has already started if it doesn't start very soon uh, more and more we need tornado shelters earthquake and tornado preparations are both important Finally, if you are worried about a major aftershock in the coming hours, I want to go out on a limb and say I do not believe there could be too much more coming. There could not be too many more big earthquakes coming. There has been a lot of earthquake energy released. Hopefully, there will not be too much more. The new moon probably only triggers the release of existing potential earthquake energy and a 5.1 at La Habra, hopefully, should be all of it. One more time, this is the EQ guy saying God bless all my friends in California, and thank you again for watching.